Hello and welcome to this video in a series of videos on Doom Z script creation. And we are going to create a rocket launcher day, or actually a grenade launcher. We already have a rocket launcher. A grenade launcher, which actually modern ports of Doom have grenades built into them. It's just not in the game. So we just need to make a quick modification. So again, look at the links in the description of the video. You can find my website there as well as this GitLab page where I have all these examples. And if you click on examples here and go down to weapons, uh, grenade, weapons grenade, that's the, what we're going to do today. But we're going to recreate from scratch. Well, kind of from scratch. Again, if we go back to the main directory here and go to extras actors, these are the default settings for all the actors in Doom. If we come down here to weapons and find launcher, we can find the rocket launcher here. So let's go ahead and copy that code. And I currently have a file, my Z script file, and we're going to look for a file called grenade.zs. A or Z S C. And so we will create that file and we will paste in the code that we just copied. And we will rename this from a rocket launcher to grenade launcher. And we will say that it replaces the rocket launcher. And down here, we will give it a weapon slot of five. So it will be at slot five. And we will also change here where it says fire missile. We're going to change that to fire ST grenade. And that should be all we do. Because if we scroll down here more in this file, you can see we have the actor for the rocket here. So we have the rocket launcher. We have the rocket. And again, these are the default settings. There's also an option for grenade. And if you're using GZ Doom, this is built in already, although we will copy this in a moment and modify it a little bit. Because when we go to run it, and I type in my cheat code, just to get there quicker, IDKFA F5, we now have a rocket launcher, or a grenade launcher. You can see it bounces the grenades around, and they eventually explode. But they don't make any sounds. Let's go ahead and quickly go back over here to the examples and we have our class of grenade. Let's go ahead and copy that. We'll put that into our grenade file here. Just append it onto the bottom. And you can see here that it has a C sound, a death sound, and even a bounce sound. Thing is, these files don't exist. Now we could create them ourselves, but if we go back to this file, I'm just going to create copy the sounds from the rocket. So I will delete these two and I will paste in these two. Let's fix our indentation. So now we have at least a sound when we fire it. That's the C sound and the sound when it explodes. Uh, I don't have a bounce sound. Uh, basically, if you go back to my video on random sounds, I show you how to create sounds. You can take WAV files and how to add those in. So fortunately, uh, in this tutorial, we're not going to have any bouncing sounds, but I just want to quickly show you that you can modify the bouncing or the, the sounds to it. Oh, what did I type wrong? Oh, right. So grenade already exists. So we're just going to call this new grenade and say that it replaces the grenade. Now we should be okay. Can't create something new over something that already exists. At least not the way we're doing things. Again, IDKFA five. <laughs> So we don't have bouncing sounds, but we have other sounds. And again, you can go in and just like everything we've been doing in previous videos, you can modify all this stuff. You can modify its speed, how much damage. You know, you can see here that no uh, gravity affects it. Uh, we, it. Grenade trails is enabled if you have that. And it has bounce type of doom, because I guess there's different bounce types depending on what port of doom you're, do you're using. And um, damage type grenade. Up here with the launcher, we are using ammo type of rocket. Of course, you could change that if you want to make your own custom ammo. Also with the rocket launcher, you might want to change the message to grenade launcher. So that when you pick one up, you know it's a grenade launcher and not a rocket launcher. And uh, that's pretty much it. You can play around with this more, but I just thought I'd show you quickly how you can uh, create basically a weapon that bounces around, which is uh, could be fun to do. Original Doom didn't have it, a lot of games since have, but now modern ports do, and all you have to do is make those few changes we just did. Again, I hope that you're enjoying this series. Uh, 
there's a lot of videos. I think this is like the 10th one so far. Uh, and I plan on making a bunch more. And visit my website, filmsbychris.com. There's a support section. If you want to support me because you like my videos, if you like my videos but can't support me financially, like, share, subscribe, and comment. Definitely share these videos. Please share these videos. And also get the examples at gitlab.com forward slash milix1000. There's a link to that in the description as well. And I'm still updating this, adding stuff. I hope that you have a great day.